Hello and welcome to another video of Lou's Lab. Sorry, I'm, I haven't uploaded a lot of video, videos for a long time, but today I'm going to talk about a real new topic. It's not science, not simulations, not space uh, games, uh, not Marvel. Uh, this time it's Star Wars. And as in, yeah, Star Wars is pretty interesting. And today we're going to talk about the top five most powerful Jedi. And, uh, okay, let's get started. Fifth spot is Anakin Skywalker. Anakin Skywalker is a powerful Jedi and the chosen one himself. So, yeah, uh, if you look out that, then you, you can already tell that he's an overpowered guy. And fourth spot, Qui Gon. Jin. Qui Gon Jin is one of the wisest Jedi around and is the guy who trains currently Yoda, and Yoda is ridiculously overpowered. And if that's not impressive, he even <clears throat> discovered the how to become one with the Force, something that Yoda was not able to do. And did not. I mean, actually he did. Anyways, third spot is Obi-Wan. As in, Master and Princess, they're both, they're both overpowered. Oh, and this ridiculously overpowered guy overpowered the Chosen One himself. And was a pretty good match for Dooku. And... Don't forget that this guy defeated a guy that Qui-Gon Jinn cannot defeat, Darth Maul. And Darth Maul has a double-bladed lightsaber, and he cut through that hilt. And he has, and he is just barely a part of one. And, oh, does that mean that Qui-Gon Jinn is not a Jedi Master? Does it? Yeah, that means that Qui-Gon Jinn is a Jedi Knight. Whoa, no way. Anyways, second spot is Mace Windu, as in, he defeated Darth Sidious, nearly. And first spot is Yoda. He's the Grand Master, that's it. And everyone knows how ridiculously overpowered Yoda is. Yeah, I mean, uh, anyways, that's it for this video. If you enjoyed, like, and subscribe, and bye!